This is Dabu7. And it sure does look like some head fakes have been thrown in terms of what our military is doing, where they're going. It looks like when Trump was asked the other day live on television what their thoughts or what his thoughts were on the failed missile test and if the United States had something to do with it, he clammed up and said, I'm not saying anything. I'm not telegraphing anything. They also told all of us that this Trump armada was on its way there. And from the first official source that put this out, they had stated that this aircraft carrier with a bunch of other boats are headed to North Korea. The USS Carl Vinson. But this is the problem. We find out today that it has not been headed toward North Korea. They're saying that someone made the error of putting out the false information to the press. Imagine that. So it's some 3,500 miles. Now this makes sense because they were talking about the 25th the other day and I'm like, man, that seems like it's taking forever for it to get there. Why would that be? And I even mentioned it during the live show, the 25th. Now we know why, because this thing was down off the coast of Indonesia. So they're doing some head fakes here, like I said, in terms of what's really going on. I can guarantee you they're positioning other things in the midst of this. And at the end of the day, now they're actually saying, hey, we may shoot down a North Korean missile. But you have to think about it like this. If the whole waterway out there, Sea of Japan, that whole area is littered with military ships, they cannot fire. It's going to come down close to one of them regardless. Regardless. And it would be the perfect excuse for them to open up fire or to definitely shoot this thing down out of the air if it's heading in their direction. Now, there's an interesting statement down here about waiting till they detonate the next nuclear test to then try to take out the, the missile launch after that. Now, why would they announce that if that's the case you see we're already seeing that they've been doing the opposite of what they're putting out and then the things they don't want to talk about it looks like they're definitely involved with like the missile blowing up as soon as it took off the way trump's acting all the other advisors they are refusing to deny that they were involved tells me it's exactly what happened trump's asked about it he gets all defensive and says he's not giving away his hand one thing's for sure. The USS Carl Vinson is not going to be anywhere near North Korea till about the 25th. So, the Pentagon considering shooting down any tests, and now the revelation that this, this aircraft carrier is 3,500 miles away from where most people thought it was going to be, what well, headed south instead of north, which is curious. They knew this, and they were monitoring everything the whole time. You see? So that's an update to those wondering. We'll see what happens. We've got a lot of warships on the move here. There's two other aircraft carriers that are supposed to be heading to the Sea of Japan, even one being sent from Ukraine. We have one that's docked in uh, Japan that's moving out into the waters, and one that was off the coast of Oregon. So that's going to be, be a lot of our ships in one area at one time. The USS Stetson, I believe that was the name of it, it entered the South China Sea here recently as well. I will continue to update with information as things change. But that's some of the latest. It's been Dabu 7.